It's hard to miss something that weighs 37 billion tons. That's the amount of fossil fuel-related carbon dioxide humans release into the atmosphere every year. The gas is entirely invisible until now. In a striking new video, NASA has revealed the release and circulation of human-produced carbon dioxide for the entirety of the year 2021. Space agency scientists drew their data partly from observations made by weather satellites and partly by Earth-based monitoring of known greenhouse gas emitters, industrial areas in the developed world in particular. The most dramatic takeaway from the video is the outsized role the Northern Hemisphere plays in the global spread of greenhouse gases compared to the far less blameworthy South. The video unspools over the course of the year, and it's not until June that the South is truly shrouded in the North's emissions. It takes that long partly because the equator operates as an atmospheric berm, with hot air rising from the Earth's midline, slowing north-south circulation. Ultimately, however, those billions of tons of carbon dioxide blow past this natural stop sign and cover the south as badly as the north. For the first half of the year before they're obscured by CO2, Australia, Africa, and South America appear to flicker on and off from green to a neutral gray. That represents plant life absorbing carbon dioxide during the day and releasing it in a sort of vegetable respiration at night. If there is any good news in both the data and the video, it's that not all of the CO2 tonnage humans pour into the sky stays there. About half of the emissions are taken up by the land and the oceans, which act as carbon sinks, entraining greenhouse gas and preventing it from accelerating climate change even further. The bad news is that there's at least another 37 billion tons coming this year, and next year, and the year after that. Until humans break their fossil fuel habit, the planet will continue to choke on the results.